here is Henry Ford. Henry Ford took people from horses and put them in gas cars. And at the bottom, if you read his net worth, $188 billion in today's dollars. Became the richest guy in the world. Elon Musk comes around, puts people in gas cars to electric cars. Changes the world, becomes the richest guy in the world. Steve Jobs took everyone from a Blackberry, put them on an iPhone. Became the richest guy in the world and changed the world. Thomas Edison wasn't content with light bulbs. Sorry, with candle lights, so he made a light bulb. Became one of the richest guys in the world and changed the world. You guys with me? McDonald's changed the world. Ray Kroc. It wasn't even his product. He saw the vision that the creators didn't see. But all of these guys changed the world and built wealth. So what problem are we solving today? Think about it. I mean, we don't have to go. Babies is out of control. Mental health issues are out of control. Our fruits and vegetables are not as nourished and uh, nutritious as they used to be. Guys, this problem is becoming worse. And so this problem is becoming horrible. Diabetes is climbing. Metabolic health problems are, are, are going crazy. If 93% of the students are failing in the school, you don't blame the students, you blame the school. So the system is completely busted. And this is the current environment we're living in. Modern food environment, you age faster, low energy, you struggle to lose weight, you go see your doctor. Now they're putting out this new drug that Bitcoin talked about. I mean, there's always a new cycle of drugs. Here it's but none of the drugs are addressing the root cause, which is insulin. The insulin resistance is a root cause, and we got the field grade program. So now, let's look at it as a business, because we're all entrepreneurs here. Novo Nordisk, the company that makes Ozempic, surpassed LVMH, Louis Vuitton, which was the richest, Bernard Arnold, was the richest guy in the world. And Novo Nordisk, the makers of Ozempic, passed it in 18 months. And that, well, do you guys catch that on Bitcoin slide? They're now bigger than Tesla. At the bottom, 90% of drug maker sales of Novo Nordisk is from Ozempic. And the anti-obesity market is going to become the most lucrative market for the pharmaceutical industry being worth a hundred billion dollars or even more. Timing is everything, guys. Just like I talked about Henry Ford, just like I talked about Elon Musk, just like I talked about Steve Jobs. With Field Great, we have not hit momentum yet. Yes, we are right here. So one person asked, hey, people are, why don't they have belief in this? 10 years ago in North America, it was just Garrett and I, guys. Look at the room today. There's 700, or what, 800, I think 1,000, I would stand in room, 1,000 people in this room, and to collectively we've helped out close to 100,000 lives with the system. Once we hit the tipping point, guys, this thing is going to go stupid. I mean, let's talk about North America. 600 million people in North America. Between Mexico, US, and Canada, we also have people from Australia here. We have people from the UK here. If you add those, you know, give or take 650, 700 million people. Based on Bigman's presentation, do you believe, forget competing with the drug companies. Give them their share, that's fine. Can we capture 1%? Yes. 1%. 1% is 6 million people. 6 million people on field grade system. But do you know what that means? That's just not the way our model works, guys. Is what I love what Dan said. We own the distribution. We are the channel. That means 56% of the revenue is shared with us. Over here, 56% of that revenue share is $4 billion in profits shared every year in our organization, guys. So you want to make 100000 a year? 
your shares in there. You want to make 500,000 a year, your shares in there. You want to make, you know, half a million a month, a million a month, five million a month, 10 million a month, 100 million a year is the record we're going to break in this business model through Unicity, mark my words. earning a hundred million dollars a year by 2030 or sooner. It will happen. Forget, you know, Wall Street. People are going to say those Unicity people, man. Those guys are making crazy money. But we're doing it on good, on helping people, on helping the average person believe in themselves, become healthier, become stronger. Guys, think about that. I want you to think about that. That is the power of what's possible because we have a product that's solving a major, major problem from the health side, but there's also the business side. Look at this. That's what Americans actually think is the wealth distribution on the top, compared to what it actually is. If you look at it, there's no such thing left as a middle class anymore. Mm. In fact, if most Americans, two out of three were to lose their job tomorrow, they don't have enough savings to cover a month's expense. Guys, we have a huge, huge, huge opportunity here, not from the product side only, but from that side only. This business allows the average person to catapult to extreme wealth, and we can do that. So Unicity is way bigger than just feel great, guys. It's health, it's hope, it's freedom, it's wealth, it's community, it's growth. And why the growth is start there? Because people are dying for growth. They're doing dumb things in society because they're not growing. And how do we give people hope that they can grow? We need to grow. We need to become stronger. But think about that, guys. We can do something massive in every single city in this continent, and Europe, and Africa, and Asia. I mean, yeah, this is big in Asia, but we still haven't scratched how big it can actually become. Well, we focus here. We build the fire here, and then the whole world's gonna see. Timing is everything. Four billion dollars shared amongst the team, guys. There's no company that's ever gonna that's ever gonna accomplish that, and it's through the one percent mission. One, this company is not just gonna change people's lives on the health aspect, but it's gonna transform people's mindset, growth, leadership, personal development, well. Everything on a level that's never been done in business before.